was that kid that doodled on their tests, you know, a few years of high school deciding what I want to do. One of my teachers was like, this is exactly what you need to do, you need to go into art. Within my personality, I have some sort of a, a need to express the inner workings of my brain. I think as a photographer, the events I am invited to as a wedding, as new baby or um, maternity, new baby, birthday parties, and graduations, graduation party, all those are all life um, milestones for a person's life. And I feel very honored to be part of their family. Nothing gives me more satisfaction. Nothing makes me feel better than completing a piece of artwork. That's got to be the best thing in the, well, one of the best things in the world. <laughs> I think I have a pretty unique view of the world. And part of that has to do with seeing beauty in, in simple places. You start off with a, uh, a boring blank piece of wood and you create it into something that uh, no one else has ever produced before. It's a little like breathing. It's something that I just have to do. I, I don't know if it's that beautiful tactile sense. I, I have to create. I think you just try to go with the feeling of your art and if people gravitate towards that and it pushes you on to uh, another thing, another level or another plateau where you want your artwork to be at, then, then that's good. I've always wanted to be an artist since I could hold a crayon. There's a certain pleasure that comes from knowing your medium inside and out and knowing what its limitations are and figuring out how to stretch those in themselves. All of the imagery means something. Everything has a purpose and a meaning and pretty much just so you need to understand the historical aspects of a traditional Japanese tattoo. I started drawing when I was like five years old. I, I wasn't even going to school, but I, I always draw something, copy, uh, and um, my father was a teacher, so he kind of encouraged me. My grandfather took me out to the swamp and taught me about recycling a reed from the swamp making a flute out of it. So when I see things, I see what else it can be. I've never sought to have a um, cut and dry paragraph statement that would define and encompass my artwork because then when I went in to create, I would always feel compelled to, to stick to that mission statement as opposed to letting the art take me where it can take me. My name is Rashad. Steve McClintock. Alec DeJesus. Ben Bedford. Rachel Haynes. Provocateur Bosley. Megan Tippy reese Ching Zedrick. Chris Dakalasa. Justin Fenwick. Derek Winstonley. Deborah Fell. Elijah Thorne Sansom. And my art works. My art works. And my art works in Illinois.